Hey guys, today's video is sponsored by Fora Thermometers. Hi guys, welcome to the beach house. It has been a while, um, but here's the truth. We had all these grand plans for the beginning of the year and we wanted to make, you know, we explained what videos we'd post and things just haven't gone as planned. I've actually been, this is the truth that I haven't been very like open about just because I've been really struggling and I've been having a lot of health problems. Like one after another after another that have been really difficult and it's been, it's been hard to want to share that with the world and so I've kind of just kept to myself about it. But you know, I thought about it and I decided, you know, I think I'm just gonna tell him what's been happening. Okay, Michael's here. So, um, I've been trying everything I could possibly do to get healthy, and it has been like hitting one roadblock after another. It's well, been very frustrating. You get sick over and over and over again every single time with a different sickness. <laughs> and I'm like, why is my body falling apart? And sometimes I'm uh, like, was she ever healthy? It's been so long. <laughs> well, like, I think, you know, five kids can do it to you. Like, and, and crazy bad luck too. I've had um, a rotator cuff injury in the last year. It's just since having Max, I've had a rotator cuff injury. I had my appendix out, which was an emergency surgery. I had complications from that after that, and I'm just barely, barely starting to feel better. Liver issues. I've had liver you issues. You had to get checked crazy out. Crazy things. Like, I've had to have an MRI and a CT scan, and like... You got an infection, uh, and you had to infection. take antibiotics. And like, my my body has been so thrown off. And through this, I've, I've realized I am not prepared for all of these things. Like, I'm not prepared to be my own doctor. <laughs> <laughs> like, I have junky tools. Like, okay, thermometers. Let's talk thermometers for a minute. I, my whole life, I've had junky thermometers that have just, like, dollar store, no joke, that have fallen apart. And, and like, I buy them thinking, oh, this will hold me off. But then if I actually get sick and I use them, I don't trust it. I'm like... They're not reliable. I'm like... Uh, this is from the dollar store. <laughs> I think I'm actually dying. <laughs> Even though it says, you're fine. We've always had such bad <laughs> thermometers that I've gotten really good at doing this. Yeah. And being like, you have a temperature of 99.1. 99. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And that's usually and what I'm I've had. that accurate either. <laughs> but I try. <laughs> and so we'll go borrow other people's thermometers and like, Try, we'll use all of the thermometers we have and kind of take like an average of all of them, which just is really frustrating. So we finally bit the bullet and we have a really good thermometer that we got in the mail and we have an opening and I'm so excited! <sighs> so along with this, we've been getting a lot of other little things to try and we have like a thing to check our ears and I just, I'm starting to become Dr. Mom. This is how I'm becoming Dr. Mom. So anyways, I'm really excited to open this because this one's really cool and it will take your temperature on your forehead without touching you. And honestly, Which like... Which is really awesome. It is. But in, in all reality, like, yeah, you need to go to the doctor if you're sick. But this just helps us to know, like, when it's time to go. Yeah. Because sometimes we're like, should we go? Should we not go? Yeah. And, and now that we've got this, it's going to be a lot easier to know. And honestly, I... I'm just getting over the infection that I had, but it was like I had a fever every other day or like throughout the day I'd have a fever and then it would go away and then it would come back and I was just like, I don't trust these stupid thermometers. <laughs> so anyways, I'm going to open this package here, Michael. Now we have a smart thermometer. Now we have a smart thermometer. I'm really excited. Fora IR42 forehead thermometer. I've seen these like at the doctor's office that yeah. they used, but I've, I've always been like, oh. If only, right? <laughs> I didn't even know that you could buy them. It's just one of those things that I haven't really thought much about until I'm like in need of it. And uh -huh. then I'm like, why, why did I hold off? Okay, looks like I need to put in some batteries. Mm -hmm. It comes with the batteries. That's nice. It kind of looks like Eva. <laughs> oh, hey, look at that. Eva. I love that. You'll never lose it. It stays on. That's handy. That's cool. 
Don't you think it looks like Eva? It does. Especially, there should be a plant right in here. <laughs> <laughs> it's cool, though. Plant in a boot. <laughs> Give me a minute. <laughs> One minute, 37 seconds later. Okay, I'm pushing it on. I've never had a high-tech thermometer. I feel so excited. Okay, is it on? Yes. Okay. Now press it again. Ooh! 97.9. Holy cow. That was really fast. <laughs> I was expecting it to be like three minutes later or something like that. I want to take yours. Okay. 97.7. What was mine? 97.9. Yeah, 97.9. Let's take our temperature. Come here, Corbin. 97.9. It doesn't even have to touch. No. Let's go take Max's. He's asleep. Oh, oh that's a great Let's idea. Do it right now. <laughs> this is the things you get excited about when you're an adult. <laughs> I'm gonna go take everybody's temperature. 97.7. <laughs> that's what it was before. Okay. Gotta go check. You gotta be quiet. been able to take a temperature so easily on a kid. They always scream. <laughs> they hate it. Maybe I'm doing it wrong, but this is amazing. So you didn't even have to touch his forehead. I didn't even touch his forehead. You didn't wake him up and you got his temperature and he was 98.6 exactly. What a good right. baby. He's so perfect. He's even the perfect temperature. <laughs> oh, James. Oh Should goodness. we check your temperature? God, he's sick. You look ill. Just kidding. Gotta make sure. It says low. 98.1. Let's go check everyone's yeah, temperature yeah. really quick. I need to take her temperature. <laughs> hey, I need to take your temperature. Because there's multiple ways of taking temperature, and I don't know if you want me to take it. Ah! My temperature! I'm so glad it's not. <gasps> Uh, 99 degrees. Have a 99 degree temperature. Is that good? Get away from you him. You guys die. Quarantine. Ah! Quarantine. Let him go back to his quarantine. <laughs> that means he's probably been like working up a sweat in there. What is he? Do? What are you doing in there? Working on a cool treasure thingy. Yeah, he's had a scar fever. <gasps> oh wow. Is, is it? Am I, is that a little bit? It is a little bit warm. I can tell. I'm a hot guy. Water. Now I have to get away from him. Just do it on the back of her neck. What is that? <laughs> 98.8. You're gonna live. Okay. You're healthy. Good job. Think hot thoughts. <laughs> Think about dad. Oh! 98.1. Wait, what's Jessica? Let's check Jessica's. Jessica. 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 98.2. It's cooler in here. Impeccable. Yeah, everybody's been normal except Ryan. Yeah, Ryan's the only abnormal one. And <laughs> it was really cool because I was able to take Max's temperature while he was completely asleep. Because it's a no contact. You, you don't even touch so the person. Nice. You just push the button and it says low and then you push the button again. I'm being serious right now, like this is the most favorite thermometer I've ever had in my life. All the other ones are trash, this is the best. Honestly, super cool. I'm that very was, impressed. I am too. I'm surprised how quick it is and so, how painless and no contact. That's especially good if you're like, this person I'm about to test might be sick. I don't want germs. Yeah, that's true. Transmitting from one person's forehead to another person's. That's a good point or armpit or other places that you don't want a thermometer going if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I 
Actually, I was thinking, what's cool about this is you could literally test everyone's temperature within seconds. Like, I could get 12 people, line them up, and do it in one minute. Like, it's that fast. You don't even have to wait at all. We'll never have to buy another thermometer again. And if the kids are ever sick, usually what I do is I'll wait for, or I'll do it to one of the kids and they already feel sick. If I'm taking their, th their temperature, they usually don't feel good. And with any other thermometer, it makes them feel worse and more uncomfortable. And I definitely don't want to do it to everybody because I'm like, you know. <laughs> no one wants to be subjected to that. And it was like painful for me too. And so this is so cool. I could do it. If anybody's sick, I'll just test everybody. Cool. I love it. If you guys are interested in getting one, you can click the link in the description below to get yours today. And it's fun. <laughs> it's a toy. Bring it to Walmart. Test everybody you're oh, walking past. Oh, one other thing I noticed. <laughs> you wouldn't even be touching them. One other thing I noticed was um, <laughs> if you're in a bright place, it has a display screen just dark. Oh, But yeah. if you're in a dark place, it automatically lights up green so you can see it. I noticed that. I wondered why it did it that. It automatically you know, can detect if it's that. dark or light where you're at. That's really cool. Anyway, oh. thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and stay safe, stay healthy. Yeah, buy one of these. It will help. <laughs>